honey bee, a type of sophisticated insect responsible for the production of that golden, viscous, sweet, sticky liquid called honey. A food with tons of healthy benefits, from healing to fighting infections, a property that gives honey quite a price tag on the market. A litre of honey averaging between 10,000 and 30,000 shillings on the market today, while an average hive produces about 40 litres of honey on one harvest. This places apiculture, also known as beekeeping, as one of the few underutilized but unique potential farming ventures to reap your seeds of gold. The question then being, what is the cost of production for beekeeping? Coming up on Seeds of Gold. Other than the cost of the beehive, you are not going to, 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 to look for food for these bees. The moment you set your beehive, local, modern or whatever, the bees will always look for that good accommodation. It all begins in the field when worker bees suck nectar from blossoming flowers, take it to the hive, deposit it in their wax honeycombs, fan it with their wings until most of its water content evaporates, leaving behind the sticky sweet liquid, honey. The quality and quantity of honey produced will heavily depend on the input of the honey farmer, also known as the apiarist. This is where Aden Kamugisha, a crop farmer turned honey farmer in Masaka, comes in. My name is Aden Kamugisha, 56 years old, uh, born from Deja, which now is Rwampara district. And uh, after school, I worked briefly for Uganda Prison Service and then joined farming. Port was my core, but I do essentially all crop farming, including coffee, including bananas, including trees, including name it. In the process of crop farming, I saw an opportunity for me uh, when it comes to pollination, shooting our sugar requirements for with Anne, we were always finding difficulty in terms of sourcing out for that Anne, leave alone the cost. So bearing in mind that we have coffee, we have eucalyptus, we have uh, bananas, we, we thought we could do this. Starting was with about, with about five hives and uh, it's associated with a lot of challenges. I didn't know how to harvest the animal myself. Even up to now, I've not mastered the art. Uh, but um, on closer exchange with those who are in the trade already, the encouragement was positive and we thought we could start. So about five years ago, we begin with our five beehives. The good bit of, uh, of it is that uh, the anne we harvested was reasonable enough compared to the investment costs. And uh, you can easily harvest twice a year. We have now graduated to 20 beehives and uh, I know with the 20 beehives we shall get enough anne for us, for ourselves and for our immediate customers who will want the quality honey we talk of. Based on the experience he went through setting up the 20 hives, Aden gives us an idea of what is needed to set up a honey farm. Incidentally, bees have been around and if you look at the biblical times, man depended on honey for food. So bees can live in trees, bees can live underground when there are like holes, but by providing a very good habitat for them, artificial or modern, in a way you are making their life easier. 
but um, to be simpler in terms of what type of beehives or what beehives one should go for, that goes in. Setting up a beehive yourself would not be my recommendation unless you really have an idea. By getting out of pocket and going for an already beehive, you are avoiding experimenting. And uh, each beehive, the maker is aware of the, because there are several uh, uh, types of the bees and each one with the responsibility it carries. So any beehive setup is, is, has that at the back of its back, of, the, the maker has that in the background. So I would rather encourage you go for the already made ones and the, in this particular case, the modern beehives because at the end of the day, they are not that expensive. In fact, the most common ones I'm going for are called uh, top bars. In other, in other instances, they are referred to as uh, Kenya, KTB, Kenya top bar beehives. Those ones are too easy and reasonably cheap. Setup because why they, they call it top bar in this case I'm always accustomed to uh, it's like um, call it a flat container with bars like those ones of the xylophone and many of them actually each 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 beehive may have around twenty of them and on each bar that hangs on that uh, container call it container this time they will make the, the honeycombs over which the the, 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 the workers will uh, make those combs, run to the field, pick the pollen, while the drones are inside fertilizing the queen and the queen putting those uh, eggs into those combs. But um, the moment the beehive is full and therefore the population is, is no longer finding it hospitable, they will, they, 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 they will migrate. Still to come on Seeds of Gold. communication. For many startups, there is a question of, can a beehive be placed anywhere? In my case, I'm living with my bees in my farm where other activities are taking place. So the choice of the point was uh, to avoid as much as possible the intrusion of the human being. But uh, bees, incidentally, are very social animals and would love because I had thought initially that we are going to scatter these beehives in the entire farm especially the coffee and the, the mangoes but he told me it is not necessary and of course making sure that where you place your beehive it is not you you, you keep checking and you can always uh, spray the, the oil around the point if it is put on a, 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 a post, for instance, so that you avoid predators. And these include the ants, they include the lizards, they include, because, they, 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 because of the young bees, these ones would want to have them as prey. 
So you need to keep checking to avoid all that inconvenience. A bit of 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 a Mpewojeda. I Walu wabuti natambulo jaku la ba mo mo site zako ezidako tu kariandula kariandula akola nyio mukufencing ati inga akola nyio mukamuli amuli sa nyio kwa ngamuli soma kamla manga tau mude hala kamuli au kwa kalu unji nyio akakariandula tu kosa nyio kosa sedi tu kosa nyio kariandula ukola sedi echo kubiri wansi ukobanga tewe nyio gasubi subi. Sana for Zirumba Nio Zirumba Nian Juchi. Can only to get a cook with anger once to Yon Yao, Alua Cado, a Cado Cafe, Bacaita B. Pascalum, get to look Simba one sea. Urukewala, a Vidira, Nemunera, Columba, or Columbum Bissi or Cugunua. To a sight of Fanaco Boy Tunga, we cut into Zimba and Zimbe, Tendabacuga. Eja kubali yokuwa mimi zinga tan. Walowe inkola, iyo muntu ngoli wa funda, tu zimba, tu zimbe mizinge ja karina. Ni ni tu kuzim ni tu zimba karina, yokuwa kumizinga nga nga kumi, nga jam nga jam nga jam nga jam nga wagul. Bebantu abali ya wafunda, wangu yuko kamani ya anti, nzate si nzendi wafunda si. Sija kurunda njuchi, haa, ah, so kurunda njuchi, nga tuko ziza kaya ndo kusinza kufunda buoboli. 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 Kaya ndo If you have successfully managed to set up your first beehive, there are a number of things you will need to properly manage handling the hives to both protect you from the bee stings and also avoid losing your investment. Mwendo wali amba dosia. Ogena mungeti. Joki ranti jogenda lutalo. Sigamanti mirembe. Mwiluba lutalo nyo lwede mire. Mkani nore chanti. Mwenyo kwe sabi kano mainti o mwede. Ntingenze kurumba. So nore cho. Tuingire duanilo. Ogoja mungeti. Osoka nore wa wezi ingiri ya. Nosoka ofuwa omu kaguno. Omu kogo. Gubuza communication kati yao nawe tolola kwa no bikula no fuwa ko e kakati nti gugu no muka guyamba ku okubuza communication kati kunya alagira Kuni baba la gira, tazi tegeira, ulokuwa tangu na unga guba 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 gufuwa, tuzo la kumanya, hili ni singola si tazi rumba, kwa ngati tazi na kufuna order. Tuni na bise de vyo kuwa kula, tuwa kula mo 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 aka, tuwa kula mimi ndiyo hivi, tuwa kula mwez. Ogwokuna, itu damu itu wakula, omwez, ogomwenda, yemi unjia bili, mumu aka, watu banga tufunye inkuba nunji, imbere yobu tu kambi ni imbere yobu denge nunji, ba na fe imbere yobu da ba nunji tu kosia, ira chini ba inkuba iza ba ntu wapata sema miti, watu fana, watu fana inkuba, watu fana mobis. 
tuina kufuna enkuba okufuna mbisi enkuba bwe tonya akamuli kamulisa nyo ero izo kweka ngo no muzinga kumunga kuvude muli ta 10 kusinzira ku mbera yo budde ngabo eri wizo kuba muli ta 10 atonzo kusanga nga embera tya bade nnunji nga temuli for every venture to have consistent growth, it must have a unique selling factor. Aden explains what makes beekeeping different. I started these bees essentially on a learning basis. But we're aware that this is income where my daily input is lessened. With the experience of poultry farming, where every day you must put in money, whether you like it, whether you have it, uh, I was looking at lesser taxing options, and bees are one of them. Uh, while I was looking at our health first, I also realized by harvesting more honey, we shall also assist those that have the interest like we have. An act he started on an experimental basis, he has come to love. Aden now looks onto building the venture to even higher scales. Starting with the five beehives, graduating to 20, and uh, going to whatever number, my focus, there is, there is a, a mentor I'm following who has uh, reached a level, for him he calls it a bee house and the minimum or maximum one can put in such an arrangement is 500 bee, bee, beehives. But to reach there, you must put a few things in place, and these include the food. Instead of taxing these bees, the worker type, to run uh, distant places looking for uh, uh, good flowers, because not even every flower a bee will be attracted to. Um, um, we are making sure that we shall plant the, 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 the types of vegetation which are too good, known and tested for these bees, so that we get enough of the production we should expect. Similarly, uh, we are going to think of uh, buying some of these extricators ourselves, but um, there is also room to call in uh, those partners who are looking for those stinging parts of the bees, because by removing them, the bee will not have lost its capacity to produce the honey, and they are around. Uh, we are talking of pharmaceutical companies. Uh, then the bees works in terms of candles, in terms of uh, uh, all industrial works. Then honey, this honey itself, which is being used in um, uh, pharmas, uh, pharmaceutical makings, uh, leaves room for us if we go higher uh, to also go for that market, which is readily available but the supply is not that pronounced as bees have been not given the attention they, 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 they so deserve. You too can make it today if you only start 